The events of the Syndagorsk conflict make up the primary action of the canon novel New Dawn. Spoilers follow. Eight years following the events of Revenge of the Sith and six years prior to Rebels, the Empire, led by the cyborg efficiency expert Count Denitrius Vidian and Captain Ray Sloan, arrived on the mining world Gorse and its moon Cinda, which is rich in thoralide, a volatile resource used in turbo laser batteries. Count Vidian, after being asked to triple thoralite outputs, devised a plan to destroy the moon in an effort to maximize short-term outputs and shirk the blame onto his rivals within the Empire. While the Gorsian miners were unknowingly prepping the moon for detonation, Kanan Jarrus, with the help of Hera Syndulla and two other Gorsian rebels, created a diversion to infiltrate Vidian's flagship, leading to his eventual death, the promotion of Captain Sloan, and the liberation of both Gors and Cinda. The conflict carries little weight in the scope of galactic history, but it acts as a catalyst for an eventual rebellion with Kanan and Hera. It is also interesting to note that the events of the conflict see Kanan using the Force several times, something strictly forbidden since the Jedi Purge. If you like these videos, please feel free to subscribe to our page and let us know what you think in the comments below. Thanks!